He goes, wait, what are you doing? Did you seriously take away MT4 and make everyone jump through all these hoops just to bring it back? Let's find out. So I got an email this morning from Hugo's Way. They say they have some exciting news about a new trading platform. Exciting for them, but not for me. Last I remember, and if you watched my previous video about Hugo's Way, they introduced TickTrader as the new exciting platform to trade on. Based on my experience, TickTrader was new, but there was nothing to be excited about. Hugo's Way must have agreed with my opinion because they're getting rid of TickTrader for another new and exciting platform. On a side note, if you have any open trades on Hugo's Way using TickTrader, you better close your positions by Thursday, December 7th. The last time Hugo's Way made wholesale changes, it was a disaster and here we go again making changes. This doesn't affect me at all. I took all my money out of Hugo's Way when they dropped MT4 or after Medicals dropped Hugo's Way. I don't think we'll ever get the truth about what actually happened, but Hugo's Way was no longer offering MT4 as a trading platform. That part we know. But back to the email. Hugo's Way said they had a new platform, but they didn't say what it was. Is it Trade Locker, MT5, C Trader? Who knows? So I logged into my Hugo's Way account to see what it shows for opening a trading account. To my surprise, they have something called an MT4 Pro Standard account. Never mind that it's a Pro and Standard account at the same time, it's MT4. After downloading it, I checked the file properties because after all the rigmarole with the new CRM and my withdrawal, I just don't trust Hugo's Way. First off, the download file size is a lot bigger than the non-broker version of MT4 that I use, and that made me a little suspicious. But I installed it anyway. I'm assuming they put a lot of the files in the installer that my version of MT4 would download in the background. Red flag number two, who is Technology Global Solutions? MT4 is made by MetaQuotes. Now I'm thinking they made a phony bootleg version of MT4 because Medicals cut them loose. After installing it, it defaults to setting up a Hugo's Way account and it does look like MT4 but to know for sure, I looked at the about information and yes it is in fact MT4. So Hugo's Way is reissuing their white label version of MT4. I don't know what back alley deal was made or how they got back in with Medicals but they do have a MT4 trading platform. I don't know how this affects other brokers that got booted off MT4 but Hugo's Way somehow found a way back in. Will I go back to Hugo's Way? Probably not right now. I don't like surprises when it comes to my trading account and my money. They messed up too many times and they had me jump through too many hoops. I think I'm going to sit back and see if they have some stability and if they have MT4 long term. Everything that I heard was that Medicals stopped doing business with unregulated offshore brokers that illegally offer services to US residents. I know Hugo's Way didn't pay for the license to get regulated here and I definitely know that they didn't move their offices here. So I don't know how they pulled this off or how long it can last. Hugo's Way makes major changes about once a month lately so I'll check back at the beginning of 2024 and see where they are even if they still have MT4 I'm hesitant about doing business with them after they told me that I need to give a reason for my withdrawal request before they would approve it my reason is I'm a grown-ass man and it's my money now pay me so you all tread lightly and be careful this is just an update to my last video about Hugo's way I'm not saying it's safe or unsafe to go back to Hugo's way or even that you should or shouldn't go back to them. Do your own due diligence and decide for yourself. Thanks for watching.